In this video, we'll discover about the science behind physical fitness. According to Dr. Chang, if the benefits of working out are put inside a drug, it would have been worth a million dollars. Researchers have always been interested in investigating the effects of regular exercise. The results have been promising. Here are some findings. Boosts the immune system. A 2017 study revealed that a 20-minute moderate workout has tremendous effects on the immune system. The study involved 47 healthy volunteers. The participants were required to jog or walk on a treadmill, depending on their level of fitness. Before and after the exercise, the researchers measured an inflammatory marker's levels, TNF. They observed that there was a 5% reduction in the number of immune cells that generated the marker. This result shows that physical activity could boost the immune system by preventing excessive inflammation. The researchers confirmed that working out has anti-inflammatory effects. Nonetheless, they were not able to explain the mechanism through which it takes place. Note that inflammation is a natural response of the immune system to injuries and disease. However, when it is excessive, it can be counterproductive. It can lead to pain and other harmful effects. Therefore, the fact that this study showed that exercise has anti-inflammatory effects is positive. It proves that it could protect you against chronic conditions due to moderate inflammatory responses. This result is liberating because it demonstrates that you might never have to invest in anti-inflammatory medications to rescue yourself from being at risk of excessive inflammatory responses. So, Dr. Chang was right when he said that the advantages of working out are worth a million dollars. Reduces cancer risk. Cancer in its various forms is a devastating disease causing many people pain all over the world. Treating it can be challenging because it often requires surgery, which is expensive and also comes with various side effects. Therefore, prevention is the best approach when it comes to this ailment. The good news is that one of the ways you can reduce the risk of having cancer is by engaging yourself in regular exercise. Studies have shown that routine physical activity is associated with reductions in incidence of breast and colon cancer. A review of several studies demonstrated that moderate physical activity is linked with a greater protective effect than lesser intensity activities. The study showed that physically active men and women have a 30 to 40 percent decrease in the risk of having colon cancer. The women in particular have a 20 to 30 percent reduction in the risk of suffering from breast cancer. The summary of this systematic review is that there is compelling evidence that working out is linked with a decrease in the prevalence of specific cancers. The authors believe people who engage in regular exercise are less likely to have breast and colon cancer in particular. The researchers also confirmed that cancer patients who are involved in recreational physical activities are at a lower risk of dying of the disease when compared to those who are less active. Prevents cardiovascular disease. Generally, regular exercise boosts your heart rate, which bodes well for your overall health. Experts believe that women, in particular, have a lower chance of dying from specific diseases associated with physical inactivity. An example of such diseases is cardiovascular disease. Moreover, studies have proven that men and women who engage in regular exercise have a lesser risk of dying from heart-related illnesses. For example, a study explored the effects of working out on the health of middle-aged men and women followed up for eight years. The researchers noticed that the lowest quintiles of physical fitness were associated with an increased risk of death from cardiovascular disease. Meanwhile, the top quintiles were linked to a decreased chance of mortality. Further research has only proven that the chances of dying from this disease are far less than earlier thought. Recent investigations have demonstrated that being fit or active offers a greater than 50% reduction in the risk of death from heart-related sicknesses. These studies also showed that physically inactive middle-aged women experienced a 52% increase in all-cause mortality. These women engage in less than one hour of exercise per week. The scientists also confirmed that these people have a 29% increase in cancer-related mortality when compared to their physically active counterparts. Decreases chances of diabetes. Diabetes can be life-changing in a negative way. Apart from causing you agony, it will also prevent you from eating some of your favorite meals. However, scientists have discovered that you can protect yourself from suffering from this disease by engaging in regular workouts. For instance, a study revealed that both aerobic and resistance types of exercise are effective in preventing type 2 diabetes. The study involved 46 participants who are involved in energy expending activities. The researchers observed that regular exercise reduces the risk of type 2 diabetes by 
they noticed that this benefit was more evident in people with a high body mass index. These participants are at a higher risk of diabetes than other participants. Nonetheless, this study demonstrated that, apart from weight loss, working out also decreases the chances of becoming a diabetes patient. Several studies have supported this investigation, proving that the findings are reliable. For example, a study involving 271 male physicians recorded similar results. The research showed that the participants who reported weekly physical activity had a reduced incidence of type 2 diabetes. The activities they carried out were sufficient to make them sweat. The researchers explained that these participants also have a lesser chance of battling a cardiovascular ailment. Improves bone health. If you want to improve your bone density, you need to have a culture of regular workout. Weight-bearing exercise, particularly resistance exercise, has the most effects on bone mineral density. A review of several cross-sectional reports proved that doing resistance training increases bone mineral density. Therefore, those that engage in these activities have a higher chance of having healthier bones than those that don't do them. More so, the authors observed that the type of sports you engage in determines your bone mineral density. For example, athletes who participate in low-impact sports tend to have lower bone mineral density when compared with athletes who are involved in high-impact sports. Therefore, although working out improves your bone health, some specific routines have more significant impacts than others. Other researchers have gotten similar results in studies involving children, adolescents, middle-aged, and older adults. Numerous longitudinal studies have examined the effects of exercise on bone health using various categories of people. The scientists recommend that more studies are needed, especially the ones involving more participants. Nonetheless, the studies so far have shown that there is compelling proof that physical activities improve bone health. They also reduce the chance of suffering from bone-related diseases. Researchers suggest that weight-bearing and impact exercise enables you to avoid bone loss associated with aging. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.